Welcome to part two of the eDesign Suite tutorial series. In this video, you will learn how to specify your application use case and select the best IC for you. To get started, you should load eds.st.com in your web browser. On the left, the Applications menu gives you access to the different design aid tools available. They are the Power Management Design Center, which accelerates the development of AC-DC and DC-DC switch mode power supplies, both with analog and digital control, with a standalone SMPS stage or in a power tree configuration. The tool also helps speed up the development of AC-DC and DC-DC switch mode LED drivers. Thermoelectrical simulators for power discretes, power modules, and automotive power devices. These tools help you select the power device, both discrete and module, that best fits your application mission profile and predict device behavior at given operating conditions. Signal conditioning design tools to help you design multi-stage analog filters, comparators, and current sensing circuits. NFC RFID calculators, which help you design antennas based on your footprint requirements, understand the range you can obtain from your RFID reader and optimize your design around the ST25R NFC reader. Let's now click on the Power Management Design Center and choose the desired component category. For example, let's choose Power Supply Design Tools and select the AC-DC type. Choose a power supply topology, for example, isolated. Select fixed frequency flyback. You will now be able to pick a product from a wide range of supported ICs. First, define your input and output electrical specifications, including line input voltage and frequency and output parameters. If this is a multiple output design, you can add and specify those additional outputs here. Now use the Features menu to apply filters and narrow down your search. For each feature, choose from a drop-down list between No Filter, Include Feature, and Exclude Feature. At any time, if you already know the name of the ST device you would like to use, you can type it directly in the search bar. Click on the selected IC for a quick recap of its features. The tool is now showing a summary of the selected design specifications, features, and schematics. On this screen, you can also explore a selection of ready-to-use evaluation boards matching your design requirements. The Start Design drop-down button gives you access to additional actions, including options to copy or share the current URL. The tool is now ready to run your design. In the next episode, you will see the tools that help you measure and refine your design's operating conditions, performance, and bill of material. Watch more videos in the series and learn your way around the tool in no time.